ತತ್ವಗುರು ಸೇವಕ ತತ್ವ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಟೆಂಪ್ರರಿ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಇಟರ್ನಲ್ ತತ್ವ ರಿಲೇಷನ್ಶಿಪ್ ಇಸ್ ಇಟರ್ನಲ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಟರ್ನಲಿ ಮೆಟೀರಿಯಲ್ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ವಿ ಸಿ ಗುರು ಮೇ ಡಿಸಾಪಿಯರ್ ಫಾಸ್ಟ್ ಅವರ್ ಶಿಷ್ಯ ಮೇ ಡಿಸಾಪಿಯರ್ ಫಾಸ್ಟ್ ಸ್ಟಿಲ್ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಜೋಗಮಾಯ ಶಕ್ತಿ ಎಕ್ಸಲೆಂಟ್ ಫುಲಿ ಸಿ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಆಕ್ಟ್ ವೆರಿ ವಂಡರ್ಫುಲ್ ಅಘಟನ ಸಘಟನ ಪಡಿಯ ಸಿ ಶಕ್ತಿ ಸಿ ಇಸ್ ವೆರಿ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪರ್ಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟಿಂಗ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ವೆರಿ ವಂಡರ್ಫುಲ್ ವೇ ಸಿ ಕಿಫ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ರಿಲೇಷನ್ಶಿಪ್ ಇನ್ ಟ್ಯಾಕ್ಟ್ ಸಿ ಮೆಕ್ಸ್ ಅರೇಂಜ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಯು ಫಾಲೋ ಮೀ ಸಿ ಮೆಕ್ಸ್ ಅರೇಂಜ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಹೌ ದಿಸ್ ರಿಲೇಷನ್ಶಿಪ್ ವಿಲ್ ಕೆಪ್ಟ್ ಇನ್ ಟ್ಯಾಕ್ಟ್ if guru disappears fast and um, say sad guru or sri guru uh, who is eternal is associate of the lord so when he disappears he enters into nitya leela isn't it goes to the abode of krishna but he, as he has taken up responsibility he has accepted disciple and he hasn't rejected it so he has a taken up the responsibility of taking disciple to the lotus feet of Krishna. That means to take him to the abode of Krishna. Do you understand? That is Guru's responsibility. Hmm. The Sat Sishya, who is Sat Sishya, as we speak Sat Guru, similarly there is Sat Sishya. Understand? As it is very difficult to get Sat Guru, similarly difficult to get a Sat Sishya. So, as it is very difficult to get Sadguru, similarly it is difficult to get a Sadsishya. Yes, Srimad Bhakti Siddhanta, Saraswati Goswami Prabhupada is a very powerful Vaishnava, very powerful Vaishnava. We cannot find such a powerful Vaishnava. Hmm? Uh, he said, just the eve of his departure from this planet, uh, he called all his disciples, hmm? and said, nobody is my disciple. He said, nobody is my disciple. Why he says? He says like that, nobody is my disciple. Because nobody has accepted my direction as it is and followed it. Do you understand? Accepted and followed my instruction, direction as it is. They have two states. They have acted in their whimsical way. Do you understand? Therefore, nobody is my disciple. Therefore, nobody hmm, has accepted my discipline. He says, such a powerful voice, know what to speak of? Others are us, you see. So, it is said, as it is difficult to get such guru, similarly, it is difficult to get such sishya. But one who is such sishya, and guru has taken up responsibility, Uh, he has his responsibility. Suppose Guru passed away fast and disappeared fast. So went into Nitya Dham, Eternal Dham, a board of Krishna. Uh, from there he has, uh, what say, he has eye upon his Satsisya. He has eye. Mm. And he is very powerful. Hmm. He, because of the manifestation of Chaitya Guru or Paramatma who is in the heart, so from that abode of Krishna, that Sadguru hmm, inculcates, what you say, potency in the heart of <coughs> Satsisya, uh, and thereby he attracts him, he attracts him. Hmm. Suppose, in the meantime, the Shishya has also left the body, also left the body. So, Shishya may be in that body or may be in some other body. If he has left body 
and accept another body in some other place. That happens also. In whatever body it may be, Sadguru, hmm, ah, who is there in its dham, hmm, has I and his satsisya. Ah. So it is not impossible on the part of Sadguru to attract his satsisya and take him to the eternal abode of Krishna. Hmm. If Sisya has taken bath in some other land, in some other body, Still, Guru can, Guru sees it, Guru understands it, Guru knows it, so in whatever place he has taken birth, uh, Guru empowers a Vaishnava or Sadhu who is there. Do you understand? If a Vaishnava Sadhu is there, Guru empowers that Vaishnava or Sadhu. Uh, through him he teaches. In that way he takes care. Or, or, everywhere, Guru himself comes down eh, to give him, uh, to impart uh, to, to jnana, to give him sikha and dikha. Do you understand? This, in this way, the relationship is kept up. Uh, in conclusion, it may be said, there is everything is done by Jogamaya Shakti of the Lord. The Jogamaya does all these things. You understand? And uh, she, mm, this way, keeps up the eternal relationship between Sadguru and Satsishya. Therefore, she, Chakshudan Dilaji, Janme Janme Prabhu